Hello Internet. Um, right, it's that gap between Christmas and New Year. Um, I hope you had a good Christmas, by the way. Uh, very relaxing for us. Um, we were all suffering with colds just before it, so uh, yeah, we had a lot of time relaxing and just catching up and, and get some good food inside us. Anyway, I'm waffling. Today, quick little job on the uh, on the ARD, on the S3 behind me here. Um, I've done this before on an ARD A4 and it turned into a right pain in the backside. So the problem I've got today, let me just show you quickly. So it's obviously got a rear wash wipe on it and you've got two jets there that are supposed to spray into the window. Um, but if my charming assistant pushes the lever forward, we will go into the cabin. Okay, as you can hear, the motor's working. So if you can do it again, we have no water coming out. So the problem I suspect, way, whoop, way, whoop. come on, stop, that's it. What I suspect is it's all blocked up in there, but to get into there, you have to take that cap off, uh, pull it back one for me, <laughs> taking my hand off. Um, take that cap off, there's a nut in there, and there's all sorts of gubbins in there as well. It's a bit of a pain in the backside, to be honest. So what I'm going to do is try and get all this off. Hopefully it's not all rusted up, because my last one was, and see if I can get some water coming through the jets. So just on a bit of an off chance, before I do all that, I'm going to try pushing a pin inside the actual jets. I don't think this will work, because I think what it is, if I remember right, there's a pipe comes up the middle there, and uh, I think that's probably where it's going to be blocked, but uh, there you go, Just stick that in there, give it a little bit of a, a wibble wobble around. Uh, probably doing more damage than good to be honest, but there you go. Right, let's give that a bit of a spray. No, nothing doing at all, so it's um, cap off. Good. Damn intermittent. All right, well, I got it slightly wrong. <laughs> it's different to the other one, so there we go. That pops off, just like that. And there is the spray nozzle. And there is lots of gunk and horrible stuff. So um, hopefully, if it is similar to the other one, that should pull out of there. So let me give it a go. And there you go, it does. So it looks literally just pulls off. So I'm going to put some compressed air through that bit and blow out any crud that's inside and give it a little bit of a squirt and see if any uh, waterfall comes out of there. Right, well there's nothing coming out of there at all. So um, yeah, that's going to get a bit more technical because I think now I've got to go inside and start uh, trying to figure that out. Um, maybe the pipe's broke, who knows. This could be a long old job. Wasn't expecting this, but hey, such is life. Well, I've had a bit of a poke and I've had a bit of a prod, and I've stuck a bit of WD down there. And um, now the um, yeah, the washer doesn't seem to be working. <laughs> hmm, maybe it's the washer that's the problem. Maybe I need to get the front of the car looked at. Hmm, but that's a bit of a pain in the backside that job because you've either got to take the inside the wheel arch off or the bumper off. Hmm, not looking forward to that, not today, it's a bit too cold. Maybe this is going to be a part two. Well, I've had a bit of a poke and I've had a bit of a prod and I've put a bit of WD-40 down there. Whoop, whoop, and nothing yet, so, um, yeah, it's not looking good so far. Oh, I need to take that intermittent off as well. Hmm, maybe just stick a bit more WD down there. Let's see if it loosens anything off. It's going to be a big job if I have to take all the bits and do I really want to do it on a day like this. It's a bit chilly to be honest. Yeah, wherever that's blocked, it's um, it's blocked quite far down into the tube. So I think I'm just going to, uh, as I have been doing, spray WD-40 in it today. I've even had the airline in there and tried to give it a little bit of a blow through, but I've probably blown more crap down the pipe than I've actually released. But um, yeah, the pump's working okay at the front. Uh, I can only assume without actually taking it to bits and having a look at it that um, that's pumping water okay. Uh, so it's somewhere in the pipe. I, I thought it was more in there, but um, mm, I'm not so sure it is now, to be honest. Um, the trouble is, the next part, if I want to go into it, you've got to take all this away. 
and taking all this plastic out is uh, no easy task to say the least it is a complete pain in the backside I think the pipe does actually run down I'm not sure it's this side the other side I'm not actually sure if you can see it probably the other side but it does actually run down one of these hinges um, but actually inside the hinge I think where well, you can pop that and have a quick look um, yeah I don't really want to because that's a bit tight and probably break it um, but it actually pops down the hinge it goes inside the car here so I may be able to find it somewhere inside the panel that uh, maybe inside there uh, but again yeah it's not going to be an easy job whichever way I attach it or attack it rather um, so for now I think I'm just going to let it soak and hope for the best and yeah it's just started raining so that, that, that tells me one thing and one thing only part two to come okay so the rain stopped so I've gone a little bit further um, what I'm trying to do now is just have a quick look inside here see if there's any way Without messing about with the bumper or anything like that, I can get to I can get to the pump. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> and that'll be a big fat no, I think. Somebody on the internet, when I was doing the wife's pump at the front here, says you don't need to take the bumper off. All you need to do, all you need to do, is take the, the inside panel off. Um, yeah, I beg to differ. I beg to differ. Much easier to take the bumper off. Um, it does look a bit wet down there, I'll be honest, so maybe uh, maybe the pipe's screwed, oh I don't know, maybe it's just too late, um, I am losing light, so I don't think today's going to be terribly successful, whatever I do, um, but yeah I think the pumps are pretty much around the, the front, so I haven't really got a chance of doing anything, let's be honest. 